coming from Chicago, everybody was warning the media, oh, good luck with Martellus Bennett. Well, Martellus Bennett has certainly fell in line. These are the buses starting to leave. We're going to throw it back to you guys. Steve Burton, Levin Reed, Dan Roach in Houston, thank you very much. The first bus. Yes, and we did Rolling. see Bill Belichick get on that first bus, <laughs> Tom Brady on the third bus. Yep. So we know that they're at least on the bus, yes. <laughs> which is the beginning of this whole trip. So this is fantastic. I want to send it out to Nick Giovanni, who is live down there as the fans send off the Pats one last time before the Super Bowl. Yeah, Chris, it looks like we are literally moments away from the final farewell here in Foxborough. I do stand corrected. I, I thought the party had ended once Tom Brady, Bill Belichick, and all the team captains had walked off the stage. Turns out it just shifted over to the parking lot right now. We're seeing helicopters circling the parking lot, following the buses every move, and we're now just waiting to see it roll by as we're, again, waiting for the Patriots to make their way from Gillette Stadium over to Logan Airport, where they're going to hop on the plane and head down to Houston for Super Bowl 51 here. It's just a matter of moments. We could see cameras up right now, phones up, all waiting to see the bus go under the uh, the ladder. You could see actually with the one more sign hanging over with four Lombardi trophies posted for all to see right now. Uh, we got fire shooting off in the air right now. There's it looks like an ambulance just went by. Sirens are blazing. So let me go ahead and step out of this shot here as you can see. The escort has begun here right now. Fire rescue making its way down the line outside of Gillette Stadium right now, followed by the first bus, and fireworks go off to send it off in style right now. The Patriots officially on their way to Super Bowl 51. The second bus going by. Fans waving in the air. We got the cheerleaders, everyone making noise right now. This is a phenomenal send-off right now. You can see the emotion from Tom Brady taking all this in. And as well as all the fans who showed up here at 5 o'clock this morning, just waiting for this moment to show the Patriots some love as they hit the road here for just the ninth time this season. 8-0 so far. They are perfect away from Foxborough thus far. Obviously, this is not a true road game, but certainly away from home. And they're going to be missed by Patriots Nation here, which showed up in droves this morning right now. And that looks like the final bus making its way from what we can tell from our vantage point right now making uh, the uh, the fateful journey here now begins the drive for five is on the move as you can see the police escort leading the way out of gillette stadium they have cleared the parking lot at this point one two three four four buses deep it looks like and now it looks like the party is starting to disperse here right now. Patriots Nation certainly showing up, making a statement here as Tom Brady and company have now left the building. They've locked up behind them, and now they're off to, as Tom Brady said, right out to the AFC Championship game, try and lock up and write the perfect ending to this season, which has thus far been very, very memorable. Chris, Nicole. Thank you very much, Nick. We appreciate it. Six buses now underway on their way to Logan Airport. You can see right on the top, one more. Yes. Go Patriots. Yes. How exciting for not only the fans, but the players. Tom Brady saying, now it's starting to feel like the Super Bowl. And to think we started the season with four-game suspension. Tom Brady now back pretty much better than ever. I think we can all agree on I that, I think Nicole. we can agree on that, Chris. Right. We appreciate you being here with us for the special report this morning on the Patriots Super Bowl rally send-off party. The buses are underway. Thank you so much for joining us. Chris McKinnon alongside Nicole Jacobs.